the National Defense Academy of Japan is situated 70 kilometers south of Tokyo. The academy was established in 1952 by former Prime Minister Shigeru Yoshida and is home to 2,000 young men and women. The cadets are split into four battalions, two of which specialize in ground defense, with the other two assigned to the naval and air forces. On one weekend every year, the academy opens its gates to the general public to celebrate its anniversary. For the recent celebrations, Transworld Sport was honored to be one of the first overseas TV programs invited along. For the cadets, the weekend provides them with the opportunity to show off the many skills they've learned to family and friends. The main event of the two days is the inter-battalion competition called Bo Taoshi, which loosely translates as pole fight. Botaoshi is a long-standing traditional event of the academy. To give us more of an insight into this game, we spoke to Major Ryo Igarashi. Botaoshi is a fight between two teams. They try to knock over their opponent's pole, or lower it by more than 30 degrees, all in the space of two minutes. The pole stands in the middle of a circle, 26 meters in diameter. Players are only allowed to make contact with others in this area. They can't punch or kick, and if a team commits three fouls, they lose. Major Igarashi was himself once a cadet at this academy and competed in the Botaoshi event. Now, back here, he's the senior guidance officer to Battalion 1, champions for the past two years. But the Major doesn't have too much input when it comes to coaching the youngsters taking part. For the cadets, it's something they must learn for themselves. They practice as a battalion and have one strict rule. If they agree a time, then they all must attend. No excuses. If someone breaks the rule, then they are penalized. Baltashi is very important here. There are lots of events at the academy, but this is the only one that all four cadet years can take part in, and they fight for their battalion's honor. They take it very seriously and work hard to win the game. Botaoshi is played by two teams of 150 players each. There are 75 attackers and 75 defenders. The defenders raise their team's pole and start in a defensive formation around it. Attackers then rush the pole, trying to pull it down. The aim of the game is to pull the opposing team's pole down before they can accomplish this same feat. Defenders form a barrier around the pole and push and shove away the attackers, who are using each other's backs as springboards to leap up towards the pole. The person at the top of the four-meter-high pole is known as the salu, or monkey. It's their job to protect the top of the pole and to watch the movement of the opposing team, as well as issuing instructions to teammates. Normally, teams will train for about a month before the event, and they practice both defensive and offensive skills. The teams use the skills they have learnt in training to come up with a strategy. Botashi takes a tournament format. The four battalions fight against each other for a place in the final. The captain of each battalion will not share his plans until moments before the game gets underway. Everything is kept top secret from fellow teammates. The cadets are not assigned their role until right before the contest begins.
Unfortunately for Major Igarashi, his Battalion 1 team are unable to defend their title. They suffer defeat at the hands of Battalion 3 in the semi-final. In the final, which takes place in front of a crowd of 10,000, Battalion 3 take on Battalion 2. Battalion 3 are the team attacking in the green tops, whilst Battalion 2's attackers are wearing blue. Both teams begin with the same tactics, circling the defence and looking for weak points to attack. Once such a vulnerable spot is found, scrums form which become ideal launching pads for the Flying Squadron, a group of quick and strong members who jump on the backs of their teammates in order to climb above the defence. It's the Salu's job to look out for any potential Flying Squadron attacks. Battalion 2 begin to bring the pole down in the late stages of the contest, but there's a mistake from an attacker as he loses grip of the pole, and this allows Battalion 3 to regain control and ultimately go on to win the battle and bring the curtain down for another year on this traditional Japanese game. In my opinion, having played Botashi as a student, the game is a matter of honour. It's as simple as that. Each battalion spends four years living together here. They develop a bond, a community spirit that they fight to uphold. The National Defence Academy of Japan has a very important mission in nurturing the future military leaders of the nation. Through Botashi, they learn not to give up and to work together as a team. Subscribe now to our YouTube channel for the very best of Transworld Sports.